Hey guys, and welcome back to my 16th episode of my playthrough of The Witcher 3 DLC, Hearts of Stone. We are about to turn that in this gun. last quest here and start the very final Two one. Points, and be quick about it. Oh, please, good sir, a bit of courtesy. So I look up, and Bob's your uncle. He downs really? half the barrel in one draft. It's quite the classy pub going Gamble. on here, and I don't see Old Gear. Oh, I'm meeting Gonter O'Dim. Master Oi, Mirror? Wait looks. Use the look of a man who knows how to drink. Thanks. You better watch out or Master hey, Mirror is going to hurt you. Don't make me beg. My treat. Okay. This is just slightly creepy. Did you literally just stop time? The fuck? Okay, this is weird as shit. Geralt's Show like, of course this is weird, I am. but eh. wouldn't you be? Time's a marvelous plaything, and a great spice to use in gingerbread. <laughs> so you were listening. Indeed, I have cat ears. I find well, something ears. I've cat eyes. Irresistible, controlling it offers so many appetizing opportunities, like spiking the soup of unsavory individuals with appropriately ghastly things. That, that was kind of nasty. Keeping it real. <laughs> you actually control time, or is this just some conjurer's trick? What difference does it make? A big one. Ooh. Let us say, time has always fascinated me. So I taught myself how best to use it. Why time, of all things? Geralt, there are four dimensions. Length, width, height, and time. What would you have me fall in love with? Width? Come now. You're really, really weird, dude. <laughs> Who are you, really? Gaunter Odin, also known... Not yeah, 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 I gotcha. <laughs> ah, so you'd rather know what it is I do. In brief, I give folk what they ask for. You might say, I simply grant their wishes. Yeah. Definitely seems like you do it for your own gain, though, and screw them and over drop in the them end. In a world of hurt. No, not I. That would be their poorly formulated wishes. Would you choose to act I'm upon and take advantage? That I give folk what they worded want. poorly. Nothing more. That the oft desired unworthy things, that is entirely the fault of their rotten natures. You're not human. That's clear. So what are you? A demon? A jinn? Do you really wish to know? Yeah, I yes. do. No, Geralt. You don't. This one time I shall spare you and not grant your wish. Eh. All who have learned my true name are now either dead or have met an even worse fate. Yet I still need you. Right, because you need me to completely screw over Old Gear and you're probably going to try to kill him. So... To what do I owe the pleasure? I wanted to congratulate you. You acquitted yourself splendidly with all geared. In fact, you've almost satisfied your debt. Dude, all you did was sink a ship. Fulfill his three wishes. Did just that. This is where you remove the brand, because we're even. Nearly. To fulfill the terms of the contract to the letter, you must do one more thing. Draw all gear to the temple of Lilvani. We never discussed that. Oh, but we mm. did. As a man of the world, you should know that every contract contains a catch or two. Small print, which, nevertheless, changes the ultimate meaning of the pact. All right. This applies to oral contracts as well. Recall that I said, and I quote, I believe, however, that all will end well. And once it does, we three shall meet and thank one another for the voyage we shared. End quote. Mm, yeah, I remember. Fulfill your end of the bargain, and I will remove the brand. You want to remove the other scars too, buddy? <laughs> that was the last time you interrupted me while I was talking to someone. <gasps> what the devil? Why is there a fly in my suit? 
You should be really happy. Didn't see you come in. How is it you're here? Just be really, really happy. You only have a fly in your soup and not a spoon in your eye. <laughs> I'm a witcher. Superhuman quickness. Just one of my many qualities. You toss this fly in my soup? No. Now listen carefully. Tell your Ataman to come to the Temple of Lovani. It's south of here. Entrance is inside a cave. <coughs> What's the commotion? Lovani's temple. Got it? Aye. Got it. Is, when's he going to realize that his spoon is missing Your and friend, that the spoon is... The medic. She were here. Ask that you look in on her. Thanks. You might want to find your spoon, buddy. Folk, did you see? You're all stranger to the bottle. literally eh? dropped dead. <laughs> he were alive, but a moment ago. Was... And my Maybe voice is cracking like a 13-year-old boy. He's soaked in blood! <laughs> With a fucking spoon in his eye, you really think he fainted? Oh, boy. So, optional, talk to Shawnee at her home. I think Shawnee had information on Master Mirror. So, I think I'm going to look into that. And her home is so very conveniently, literally right here. So, I can't not go in here. Where's her damn door? It's what, does she treat patients in her home? She must. Shawnee. <laughs> Geralt, good thing you're here. Why, do you have a monster for me to slay? <laughs> what happened? Somebody break in? This? Uh, no, just getting ready to move. What? When, Where when, to? When That's to? what I was going to say. Not what I wanted to talk to you about. Or at least not own me, but... I'm leaving, Geralt. The Eastern Front beckons. I'm Kedwin bound. Uh, I hope this isn't because of Never me. Never mentioned you'd be moving. Any intention to either. I didn't know I would be. Found out this morning. She has a nice place, though. Two soldiers came to my door, said Redania needs me again. Couldn't turn them down? Just say no? Uh, perhaps I could have. But I didn't want to. Treating the ill and wounded, it's my calling. No place I'm needed more than at the front. Doesn't seem very pleasant. Sleeping in tents and everything. I understand. Any chance we'll see each other again? Someday, I'm sure. Hmm. So, learn anything about Olgird? Well, I abandoned the books quickly. Decided that if I was going to learn the truth, I'd need to find someone who knows him. Probably. Find anyone? Pretty Turned good out idea. I didn't need to look far. A colleague at the Academy, an assistant to Professor Permethine Shakeslock, claims Olgird von Everett met with the Professor multiple times. Apparently, Olgird asked the Professor to do some research. Professor got so worked up doing it, he went daffy. Started jealously guarding his notes. Wouldn't even let his assistant look at them. The Professor. Hmm. Where will I find him? Here in Oxenfurt. Cloistered inside his house on Academy grounds. Mage hunters guard his door. Mage hunters. Is he a captive from them, or is he on their side? Mage hunters at the door. He under house arrest? I can't say, really. Some of the faculty think him a traitor. Say he sold out to the hunters for a hefty pouch of gold. The assistant, on the other hand, insists the professor wants him there to protect him. I don't know what from. What's your guess? He's certainly useful to them. A specialist in black magic and the occult? Must be a trove of knowledge. If he's really gone off his nutter, I wouldn't be surprised to see them using him. <laughs> oh, right. I guess we're gonna to try we'll to go get together. into the, what, the academy? Redanian guards all over the academy. Doubt you'll get in alone. Guards have never stopped me. You know that. Mm. Wound these, and I'll have to patch them up. What if Besides, I kill him? we might run into a friend. Get inside free and easy. That's kind of doubtful. She can get in, but I am very, very obviously a witcher. So, probably not going to work out too well. But what am I going to need so to do So how here? are things at the Academy these days? You mean since Radovid shut it down? I mean, mm. is it well guarded? Might be all it is. Many of the faculty fled to the far north. 
The braver ones stayed, but assumed the guises of tailors and laundresses. Why? Just curious. Scholars seem to have adopted mage tactics. They in the same bind? So the Eastern Front, and then? Depends where they send me. Wherever it is, take care of yourself. Always do. So don't worry. Is this going to be another one of these awkward dialogues the whole time while we run to a certain location? And just says, oh, it's nearby, don't you worry. Just follow her while at least there's no slow walking pace in Witcher, really. Everything is at least um, like a run, but it's not a sprint. I'd prefer to just sprint all the way there. Am I going to have to kill these guys? Halt! By order of King Radovid, no one's allowed inside the academy. Do assholes not realize not that he's lectures. dead? No one means no one. See, you've become quite the stickler, Norbert. You were much kinder when I was patching you up. By the way, how's your knee? Fine. Dandy. As if no arrow ever struck it. Consider yourself a lucky man. Because if I'd not decided to operate, you'd be a cripple to the end of your days. Oh. <clears throat> Bruno? Hey? Maybe we ought to let her in. She's a decent lass. Not like to steal nothing. Hmm. All right. But alone. Which will draw too much attention. I'd rather not get chite from the captain on his account. Here's what okay. we'll do. I'll go in, then help you sneak in around the back. They can hear us. No. Don't know, but I'll figure something out. Usually aren't nearly as many guards on the riverside. So I'm swimming. Agreed. All right, let me in. Okay, they definitely heard us. We we're solid six feet away. I guess they just don't care. Okay, so what? I'm running up and around. Going for a little swim, it looks like. Okay, so it looks like I'm gonna have to... Can I just jump off here? This ought to work. No need to run back across the bridge and everything. Hopefully they don't see me if I'm up here. Oh, I can't get up? Oh, okay, now I'm up. There we go. Uh-oh. What, drowners? Oh. Okay, this isn't bad. Come on. You guys all dead? Looks like it. Garrett. Okay, are we just waiting Psst. on her to yep, drop a rope? Yeah, figure. I'm here. Where'd you get a rope? Grab the line. No, I was just gonna look at it and wonder what it was for. Where'd Did you, you just get have the rope? Line? Yeah, that was my Long question. Story. But we've I wasn't done there well. for long. <laughs> Professor Shakeslock's house is at the end of this street. Witch hunters guard the door. Doubt I'll be able to sweet talk them. Been a huge help well, already, Shani. Thanks. It was nothing. Really. You'd have done the same for me. I, if I did you save you from a crazy toad prince. I'll be at home. Packing will take some time yet. All right. Be seeing you. So she's going to walk out and the guards are going to be like, huh, where's the witcher? Time to get into a little bit of a tussle here. Oh, I can level up. Ooh. Okay, guys. No need to get so rough here. Okay, fine. If you guys want to play like that. Nope, you're dead, huh? Dude, you're just gonna die while you're trying to reload the damn crossbow instead of taking out your sword. I don't even care about taking damage right now, to be perfectly honest. Okay, so... That one's locked. Locked tight. Need another way in. You leave a window open, maybe? That's what I was- that's- I was looking up. Hmm. How would I get up, though? Oh, you know what? I bet if I go up the ladder, I can then... Up through here. There we go. I was trying to figure out how to get to this ladder, because I spotted it. Does he, I don't think he knows we're coming. And if I were him, I'd be kind of freaked out right now that there's just some dude on his roof. Is there any purpose in me coming up here? Doesn't really seem like it, for being honest. Um, 
Okay, I'm just going to assume that if I jump... Whoa! Whew. There we go. Okay. What? So I just art it open? There we go. Like, did that... Oh. That might have been slightly aggressive. I hear someone panting, so we probably freaked him out. What? Can I not... There oh, I had to do it twice? Why didn't it just break initially? That was weird. Sure, I'll steal all your alcohol. <laughs> Stairs, got it. God, this place has been looted to, like... I mean, I'll take his books. It might have something useful, but still. I'm not seeing anything particularly striking as being useful. Okay, down a floor. Frank, Is that you? Are you Leave blind? Leave the bed pun in the usual spot. And take the platter. I shan't be eating today. Professor Shakeslock. Who's the blazes? How do you get in? Get out. I know nothing. Don't wish to know anything. Understand? No, no, no. Out. I'm not, not gonna, gonna kill a blind you. man. That demon sent you. I'm sure of it. Oh. He means what Gontier, demon? probably. Feigned ignorance. <laughs> Please. You know. Gaunter old dim. Evil incarnate. He didn't <laughs> send me, but he is why I'm here. I'm a witcher. <laughs> a mutant. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Why are these walls looking like they're going to collapse here? Why are there guards outside your door? You a prisoner? Protective custody. That's the phrase. Protective. <laughs> when I cannot decide my own fate, cannot breathe without their permission. So are you on a hunger strike? You? Since you refused your You may food? not be aware, but I am one of the foremost experts on the occult. Living I'm experts, aware. that is. My mentor was the outstanding Professor Lionel Van... And you're cooperating with the witch hunters now? Cooperating? As if I had a choice. They're ignorant. But not enough to ignore what I know about magic, witches, sorceresses, what have you. Knowledge they use for barbaric ends. But that's beyond my control. Yeah. Came here because I need information. <laughs> Think you might be the only man who has it. Hmm. A witcher. Then it follows I needn't fear. I'm hardly a post-conjunction creature. What did Olgierd von Everick want from you? I curse the day I first set eyes upon the man. Uh -oh. He appeared <laughs> at my doorstep one day, offering a sack of gold were I only to find out who Gaunter Odim is and how to get rid of him. I agreed. Such matters are my speciality. And I needed the coin. I pored over countless tomes, delved into obscure incidents, and analyzed folk legends. Legends? He's that I went old? so far as to travel to Nilfgaard, the library there. Nilfgaard's not that far away, dude. I hit upon the mysterious entity's trail. There are records of encounters dating back thousands of years in many cultures under many names, but always as evil incarnate. In this land, we call him Gaunter Odim. At times, Master Mirror, or the Man of Glass. In deciphering the ancient scrawlings, I went blind. Yet I learned a great deal. For Wait, example, so there was a curse to prevent people from continuing to read, maybe? Thrives on pacts above all else. Seemingly harmless contracts, which drive their parties to madness. Interesting. Know anything else about the man? Gaunter Odim is no man. He is evil. Evil which assumes various forms. Forget about him or die. You're alive. Alive? Yet I live in constant fear, born of what I've learned about him. So, okay, this is getting really creepy. What's with the surroundings? These runes, what do they mean? They protect me. Here, evil cannot touch me. How do you know? He told me himself. He paid me a visit once. Fascinating meeting that was. I was blind already, but saw him clearly. He smiled at me. 
said he was honored I'd taken such an interest in him. He wished to thank me and explained he'd taken a similar interest in me. He drew the circle and said I'd be safe within it. His way of repaying me, you see. Ever so you can't leave, leave the freaking circle? If you'd circle? heard how he said it, you'd be as certain as I am what leaving would bring. So what, do you pee in a bucket and someone takes it away? And you eat there and you sleep there? What if you're longer? What if you, like, roll out of it in your sleep? You're literally trapped in a 6x6. Six six. This is horrible. Oh, Gird sign one of these pacts with him. Brilliant deduction. But have you guessed why? You must know that he came from a wealthy, influential line. He must have, if the family of his betrothed accepted him. Yet did you know his fortune soured? He himself became an outcast, impoverished. Iris's family, a powerful house, could not accept this. Would not marry their daughter to a nobody. Uh-oh. All geared wished to elope. The further away, the better. Yet Iris refused to cut her family ties. Quite the predicament. Indeed. Their luck turned yet darker when a wandering witch mentioned a solution. A man who would grant any wish. His name, Master Mirror. Okay, but he the didn't get the girl in the end. Naturally. All geared and all dim. A meeting at a crossroads. A wish. A pact signed in blood. And a price to be paid. Olgird was to sacrifice one he loved. Old Dim delights in difficult choices. He knew Olgird loved two in this world. His betrothed and his brother, Vladimir. Olgird chose and soon thereafter married his beloved Iris. His fortune restored. Wait, so he's the reason his brother's dead? Holy shit. So did Olgird kill his own brother? No. Oh, no. Deduce, Witcher. Odim acts directly or indirectly. Hmm? Olgird merely signed the blood letter. The next day, his brother was dead. Shit. Olgird tell you all that? He had to. How else was I to diagnose his case? Make it sound like an illness. It is worse. <laughs> Many illnesses are treatable. But play with evil... Medicine can be much harder to find. Shit. Why was all geared out to get rid of Odim? He'd gotten what he wanted. Had he? His heart had turned cold as ice. His feelings for his wife, for whom he'd sacrificed his brother, had withered. He'd lost oh, all he'd loved. Had he wanted any of this? No. Odim grants what you wish. Not what you want. All who sign a pact learn the difference and die by it. All? Why no do we keep looking at the ceiling? Kill him, you mean? Kill evil? <laughs> no. Yet the annals tell of a man who dissolved his pact by defeating Old Dim at his own game. Meaning? Old Dim wields contracts, word traps, duels of wits. Challenge him to such a duel. He'll agree. And can be beaten. But remember, there is only ever one stake. The sole thing he truly desires. Human souls. What the fuck? Odin left a mark on my face. Any way to get it off? A mark? No mention in the tones. Strange. Unless... Unless it will disappear once your pact is fulfilled. If I That's challenge you likely. end the pact that way, will it go away? That I do not know. The one man who succeeded bore no mark. He bore no mark before? Or he bore no ma mark after the fact? That's the important part of that. Thanks. Helped me a lot. Good. Very good. Ah, oh, to feel useful after so many years locked up, living in fear. Why, it's pleasance itself. Oh shit, he's out of the circle. Really? Did he just break his neck because he tripped on a bottle? 
he walked out of the circle. Well, he's dead. Key to his house and his journal. Oh boy. Now that, that is an interesting one. At least I can go out the front door now. Shit. Well, guys, really hope you enjoyed this episode of Witcher 3. Uh, that got kind of fucked up pretty quickly. This is a really nice university, by the way. Yeah, shit, I guess Skontra Dim does get what he wants. So I either get the side with him, I presume, and just let him kill Olgeard and I guess harvest his soul, or I can choose to challenge him to like a game of wits or whatever and maybe put my soul up as collateral and possibly die, which won't really happen, so I presume I win. So I'm going to side with Olgeard because although Olgeard is kind of fucked up and basically sacrificed his brother, uh, clear got Clearly, Gontor Odim is even more evil, so I'm going to try to get rid of this dude. So, subscribe, leave a like, and I'll see you in the next one.